Finally, the CDC is issuing new guidelines on face coverings to prevent the spread of the coronavirus. 8 News Now reporter Kate Houston shows us how a local business is now stepping in to help. The CDC says people should now be wearing cloth face coverings inside of places where social distancing is difficult to maintain, such as grocery stores or pharmacies. The CDC citing recent studies that show a significant amount of people with the virus lack symptoms and can transmit it to others without knowing. As a response, the CDC advises that people use cloth face coverings made from household items or common materials when in crowded public areas. <laughs> Local print shop Art Corps is assisting in this effort. Over the past week, they've teamed up with a uniform maker to produce 25,000 cloth masks for local construction workers. They're now working to help even more people. Now that that's, there's so much need, uh, I was actually talking to my, to my team uh, last night uh, regarding going public with it and, and see how we could approach that market as well. Don't have a game plan. Everything's changing by the minute, so... You know, we're just trying to think out of the box and come up with solutions uh, to help the community at the same time keep my, my guys working. The CDC, along with Governor Steve Sisolak, want to remind the public that the cloth face coverings recommended are not surgical or N95 masks. I do not want people to go buy surgical masks or N95 masks that are so desperately needed in our hospitals to wear to go to the grocery store and pick out your produce. I want people to practice social distancing in the grocery store. Would it be a nice thing for them to wear a scarf or bandana in the grocery store? Yeah, that's probably a good idea. The CDC says it's still crucial to practice six feet of social distancing to slow the spread of the virus. Kate Houston, 8 News Now.